Come on, Trotro, hurry up. Ah, uh, ah, uh, I won the sack race. Uh, uh, I'm the winner. Yes, darling, you are the winner, but now you have to get out of the sack. I don't want to. It's my lucky sack. Uh, uh. <sighs> uh, uh, Daddy, I won the sack race. Just look how high I can jump. Trotro, uh, uh, stop that. You'll end up falling over. Don't worry, I'm the best! Uh, 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 okay, uh, champ, why don't you go and play uh, in your room until supper's uh, ready? Uh, yum, yum! Okay! Watch out, Trotro! Uh, uh, uh. Teddy! I won the sack race! Uh, great! What can I play with? Ah, uh, I know! I'll play with my trucks! Uh, uh. uh oh! I've lost my sack! Bad luck, toys. I'd rather play with my ball. Oh, I can't play with my ball either. Oh, I know. I'm going to play at sack racing. Oh, you should have seen him. It was like a baby elephant trying to skip. Trotro, Trotro, leave your sack now. Supper's ready. Are you going uh, to eat like that? Yes, just watch. <laughs> uh. <laughs> All right, everyone, let's eat. <laughs> Come on, my little sack racer. Eat everything up and then you can have your bath. Yes, Mummy. Trotro, come and have your bath, please. The water's just right. Here I am. I'm ready. Oh, no, Trotro. You are not going to have a bath in your sack. But, Mummy, this is my lucky sack. I can't take it off. You are not putting your sack in the bath, Trotro. You'll get it soaking wet. I have an idea, Mummy. After my lucky sack. Uh, 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 you aren't going uh, to sleep in your uh, sack, are you, Trotro? Uh, uh, uh. Oh, can I, Mummy? Can I keep it on, please? All right, you can keep it on, but only for tonight. Thank you, Mummy. La 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 la. Notice me. This isn't fair. What can I do to make her notice me? What if I scared her? Like this. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, I don't think she would really like that. And anyway, I don't really want to make Zoe cry. I'll go and ask Daddy. He must know because he made Mummy notice him. Daddy, Daddy, Daddy! Daddy! Yes, Trotro, what do you want? What did you do to make Mummy love you? Well, I, uh... I took her dancing. Dancing? Wow! What a great idea! But I don't know how to dance. Daddy, can you teach me how to dance, please? OK, Trotro. Now look, just do what I do with your feet. That's great, Trotro. That's it. I can do it. I know how to dance. Thank you, Daddy. Where are you going, Trotro? To the sand pit to ask Zoe for a dance so that she'll like me. That's nice, Trotro, but can you dance? Uh, no, not really, but... Come on, I'll show you. You see, Trotro, it's quite easy. 
You clap your hands and then you turn. I clap my hands and I turn! <laughs> I clap my hands and I turn! I clap my hands and I turn! Whoa! Oh dear, now it's the garden that's turning! <laughs> now you're ready, Trotro. Go and ask Zoe for your dance. Thank you, Mummy. See you later. Uh, Zoe? Hello, Trotro. Zoe, um, would you uh, would you like to dance with me? Dance? OK, Trotro. Dance? Right. Do I do what Daddy showed me or like Mummy? I know. I'll do both at the same time. That'll work. Trojo, what are you doing? <laughs> Whoa! <gasps> You're really very funny, Trotro. <laughs> Dancing really does get you noticed. Trotro. Do you want to play football with me? Hmm. I've still got a lot of things to do, so not now, Trotro. Oh, that's a shame. Well, why don't you go and ask Daddy? Ah! Oh? Goal! Ah, nice shot, Trotro. Thanks, Daddy. Would you like to play football with me? Not now, Trotro. I'm a little bit busy. Oh, you too. Can I help you? Uh, of course. That's a great idea. Could you put the leaves in the wheelbarrow? Uh... Well, how about you ride your bike a little while I finish up here? One, two, oh. three, four, five, six. Hello, Lily. Do you want to come and play? Nine. Ten. Huh? No, not now, because I'm in the middle of counting up to a hundred. Twelve. Eight. Twelve. Oh, thirteen. Up to a hundred? Wow! Not now, I told you. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty. Twenty-one. Twenty-two. Oh. Twenty-three. Not now. 20... Not now. But now is when I really want to play. <laughs> Well, at least you've always got time for me, Teddy. Once upon a time, in Africa, there was a giraffe and a zebra. And they loved playing football. But one day, the ball ended up falling right next to a rabbit that was hiding in the grass. Ha! <laughs> huh? <laughs> Trotro? Huh? Yes? I've finished counting now. Do you want to come and play? Not now. As you can see, I'm a little busy. Oh. So the rabbit kicked the ball really, really hard. Trotro? Trotro. Oh. What about if we all have a game of football? Uh, sorry. Not now. Maybe later. I'm already busy. Daddy? I've just tidied the attic. All this is to be thrown away. Let's see what I can find. <laughs> oh, my duck! I used to play with this when I was younger. But your 
dirty. I'll give you a wash. You're clean now. Come on, let's go play outside. Here we go, little quack quack. I've got an idea. Quack quack. Hmm? Quack quack, quack quack. <laughs> well, well, what do we have in the garden then? <laughs> I fooled Mummy. She thinks that it's a real duck. <laughs> Oh, look, there's a cute little duck. <laughs> oh, you found your old quack quack. <laughs> quack quack. Quack quack. Quack oh, quack. That makes a really great castle, Lily. Quack quack. Quack quack. Quack quack. Quack quack. <laughs> quack. Are you a duck, Trotro? Quack quack. Can't you talk anymore? Quack quack. And listen to this. <laughs> quack, quack. Shall we pretend to be an orchestra? Listen. All right. Trotro? See this feather that I found, Lily? It's really pretty. That, that's a horse. Oh. And that's a shell. I found this on holiday at the seaside. And look, I've got these three conkers. My whistle. <whistles> oh. And that, well, that is a candle to put on a table. Oh. And here is my flower-scented soap. Smells good. Oh? Can I have it, Trotro? I love things when they smell good. No! Give that back, Zoe. It's mine. Oh. Here you are, Lily. I'll swap your marble for the three conkers. No, your <gasps> conkers are old and not very nice. No, I want to swap this oh. for your funny candle. My flower and candle for a marble? That's nowhere near enough. Wait a minute. I know what else I can give you. Oh. So then, what would you like to swap for your lovely smelly soap, Trotro? Let's see, let's see. Now, I can give you that. That? But what is it? It's for your hair. But you can put it like that. Trotro, you look very handsome. Oh, you think so? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Well, okay then, Zoe. Here you are. Oh, great. My lovely little soap. Look at all my nice things, Trotro. Oh. A nice blue rabbit key ring. And a hairbrush. And a mirror with lovely decoration. Oh. 
potion. I'll swap you my pretty mirror <gasps> for your frog. Huh? No, Zoe! <gasps> that lovely candle <gasps> is mine! I asked Trotro first. Hey, stop! <clears throat> You'll break my frog! It's true, Zoe. Lily did ask for it first. Here, I'll swap you my marble and this. Oh, a beautiful yellow car! And what if I swap my decorated mirror for your shell? Is that okay, uh, Trotro? Vroom, vroom. Okay, Zoe! Vroom, 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 it. vroom, it. vroom, vroom. It. It's really great fun to swap things from our boxes of tricks. Mummy's still sleeping. You mustn't make any noise. Oh. Good. That's better. Now, why don't you play a nice quiet game in your room? OK, Daddy. A quiet game. So no drum. Nor the ball. Nor my roller skate. Everything I like to do makes a noise. Ah! Now that is a quiet game. Choo-choo! Choo-choo! Make way for the train! Choo-choo! Choo-choo! <sighs> oh. Shh, Trotro, you know Mummy wanted a bit of a lion today. Was I making noise? Yes. Yes, it is. But everything I like to do makes a noise. I could play going to sleep. That's a quiet game. But it's a bit boring. <laughs> now that's not too noisy. I am a monster! <coughs> ah! Oh, you scared me, Trotro. Shush, Daddy, you're making too much noise. You'll wake up Mummy. <laughs> up your things? Oh, uh, well, um, I can't tidy things up. Oh, really? And why is that? Because I'm too little. I'm just a baby. Really? Well, I think you're a bit big for a baby. 
So to be a real baby... Um, I have to find... Ah, a baby's bottle! Oh, and a baby's dummy! The problem with push chairs is that you can't take them into cinemas. Into cinemas? Oh yes, that's right. What a pity. Just when I was thinking that we could all go and see a cowboy film. A cowboy film? It's not the end of the world. Oh well. We could go to the sand pit. Yes, yes. The sand pit is better for babies. Hang on a minute, Trotro. What are you doing? Can't you tell? I'm all grown up now. I'm not a baby anymore. I am Trotro, the biggest cowboy in the West. <laughs> Okay, Trotro. If you need me, I'm just next door. No, I know how to do it by myself. Now, some lovely yogurt and a cup of flour. No, nope, two cups. Oh, that's not going in very well. Now we have to mix it all together. Mix, mix. And now a cup of oil. I know this recipe really well. And now a cup of sugar. Daddy! Daddy! Yes, Trotro? Can you get the sugar for me that's up there, please? Do you want me to put that in your bowl? No, thanks. I can do it. And an egg. Oh! Oh, dear! It's smashed! Oh, and that one's messed up as well! Ah, oh, now here's a nice kind egg for the mixture. Stir and stir. And there we are! Daddy! I finished my cake! I'd better turn the oven on, Trotro. Yes, but I'm the one who's going to check the cake while it cooks. Well, it's going to take about half an hour. So I have time to go and cut Mummy a lovely bunch of roses. Ow! Oh. Naughty rose! Watch out, Trotro. The thorns will hurt you. Could you pick them then, Daddy? But I'll give them to Mummy on my own. Daddy, the cake is cooked, but you're the one who's going to have to take it out because it's dangerous. Mmm, that smells great. Mummy will be happy. But for Mummy to be really happy, you should also tidy the kitchen. Uh, I don't know how to do that on my own. <laughs> <laughs> Yoo-hoo, it's me. Here, happy birthday, Mummy. Oh, Aunt 
they beautiful? It's really kind of you. Thank you, Trotro. Come on, Mummy. There's a surprise in the kitchen. I made this all by myself. Oh, what a beautiful cake. Thank you, Trotro. And just look how tidy the kitchen is as well. Oh, well, that was Daddy who did that. Thank you, Daddy. Mmm, and tasting your cake is something else I know how to do by myself. <laughs> Here, Trotro, can you go to the vegetable garden and pick a few vegetables? Oh, great! I really love doing that! Now, for my soup, I need one potato, two leeks and three carrots. Can you remember all that? Yes! One, two, three, I'm as happy as can be. Four, five, six, carrots I will pick. Seven, eight, nine, leeks and spuds will be fine. Hello, little vegetable garden! I've come to do some shopping for Mummy. There are the carrots. Ugh. This is difficult. Ugh. Why don't you want to come out, little carrot? Ugh. Ugh. What is it you do that makes you so orange when you spend all your time underground? And one. Uh, and two. And three. OK, I'll just pick one more. This is such fun. Uh, uh. Uh. <laughs> These leeks are really funny. It looks like they've got little white beards. Uh. <laughs> This one is just like Father Christmas's beard. Now, have you been good, my little children? I'll just pick two more leeks so that I can make Father Christmas's hair. <laughs> now, it's always a surprise with potatoes. You're really small, you are. Maybe there's a bigger one over here. Ah! Hello there, greedy snail. Do the lettuce taste good in my vegetable garden? There we are. I've got everything we need to make Mummy's soup. Yum, yum. A lovely pear just ripe to eat. This is for Trotro. Um. Here you are, Mummy. But Trotro, you've picked far too many vegetables for the soup. I know, but you can make a lot more soup now. You know I really love soup. <laughs> 